Good evening, my name is Damien Wallace and welcome to Cork Opera House for this the third edition of Up Close and Personal. We have a fantastic show lined up, promises to be a night of entertainment, of banter, of conversation and most important of all, an important night for the two charities that we're fundraising for tonight, Glen Rovers and the Mercy Hospital Foundation. I want to thank each and every one of you for your contribution over the last three years to supporting the event, purchasing tickets and being here because it has truly been a remarkable achievement for the people involved and they have put the money to great effect. Over the last three years we've had a fantastic array of talent, truly the best people in their field in sport, different types of sport and to each and every one of them who've made that contribution over the three years, I want to say thank you. My name is Dr. Derek Power. I'm a consultant medical oncologist in the Mercy University Hospital. It's very clear from National Cancer Registry data that the numbers of patients with cancer is increasing by significant percentages. The, the earlier cancer is detected, the higher the chance of cure. So all of this is only possible with funding um, from either philanthropy or foundations like the Mercy Foundation. I'm Paul Sweeney, I'm a consultant urologist here at the Mercy University Hospital. Last year we diagnosed 40 men with testis cancer and about 250 men with prostate cancer. It's through your support of events like this that the Mercy University Hospital can continue to provide high quality medical care for patients in Cork. Okay, my name is Ken Murphy, I had prostate cancer. As people know, men have a problem about going to doctors. They fear the worst at all times. So all the lads out there who think they're safe that they're 50 and more, they're only cutting yourself. It's a simple thing to get a PSA test along with your normal annual checkup. Cancer has changed its ways. The type of people that attacks now, they attacks earlier. It's very important that we wake up as men and get tests done. My name is Michal Sheridan, I'm the Chief Executive of the Mercy Hospital Foundation. We're standing on site in the new CT centre at the hospital, a project that's costing over 2 million euro, a project to which we're contributing 1.1 million euro. And this new CT centre will have a massive impact on the hospital's ability to more effectively diagnose conditions as quickly as possible. All of the money that's raised by the foundation uh, comes from the general public from events like Up Close and Personal. It all makes a difference, it all adds up and we just want to thank everybody for their generosity. Hi, I'm uh, Patrick Horgan and uh, I play Ireland for Glen Rovers. The event is great because it allows us to raise money to develop all the children in the club. My name is John. Anisha. My name is Ashley. My name is Katie. My name is Kaylee. My name is Duncan. My name is Jeremy. My name is Carl. And I love Kogi. And I play for. I play for. And I play with the Glen. I like playing for the Glen. And I play with the Glen. It's a lovely club. It's really good. It's a great club to play with. <laughs> I don't know what to say. My name is Steve McDonald and uh, I'm a member of the Glen Rovers. And so I was. I'm the age of about six <laughs> and um, I've been playing with the Glen since I was six years of age up until my career now which I'm 24 this year and uh, I suppose from where I live is I only live up the road it's about two minute walk and I suppose I would have came down here nearly every day of my life up until now in, at 24 I still find myself coming down here nearly every day so the Glen has taught me a lot of things and I suppose looking around to see the young fellas I know that they're, they're where I was about 10 or 15 years ago and I hope that under my age, they'd be, they be able to say the same thing, that they've been them a lot of good things in their life. My name is Dermot McAuliffe, I'm chairman of Glen Rovers Hauling Club. We have in the last seven or eight years undertaken some major projects in development in the club, namely uh, flood lighting, redevelopment of a third senior pitch, or gym, uh, dressing rooms, and this has cost the club uh, a vast amount of money. The money is raised from the up close and personal show for the last two years and again this year have re helped reduce our debt to a manageable level. Over the last three years we have put coaches into the local schools to try and nurture an understanding between the schools and the club and how much the youth of the, of the community means to us. So now you've seen where the money goes and to each and every person associated with it I say thank you for your contribution 
the money that has been raised has been put to very good effect and we look forward to an exciting and enjoyable show this evening. It's now my pleasure to hand you over to our event, to the sports stars who are going to continue that great tradition. Thank you and enjoy the evening. Oh. Oh. Huggy Mist! Oh boys, I'd actually. <laughs> <laughs> I just go Huggy Mist! <laughs>